Hello students, the topic is effect of temperature on the opercular movement in fish and calculation of Q10. To study the influence of temperature on the opercular movement in fish. The respiratory organ in fish is gill. Operculum covers the gill chamber. Water will enter through the mouth of the fish and come out through the opercular chamber. So, the ventilatory movement or the respiratory movement, you know, ventilatory movements or respiratory movements are the movements which help an organism to breathe. In aquatic environment, temperature plays many role in organisms. Have a look on the influence of temperature on fish. Here shows the influence of temperature on fish metabolism, feeding, growth, reproduction, distribution, depth, swimming speed and survival. The principle of this experiment, you already studied about Van Hoff's law. That means for every 10 degree Celsius increase in temperature, the rate of biochemical reaction doubles. Here, the ventilatory movement increases with increase in temperature as the metabolic activity increases as well as the level of dissolved oxygen decreases in hot water. The ventilatory movement decreases with the decrease in temperature as the metabolic activity decreases as well as the level of dissolved oxygen increases in cold water. Anyway, an optimum temperature is an optimum temperature is required for the normal metabolic activities and normal enzymatic activities. Let me can see the procedure of this experiment. The materials required for this experiment are fish tank, healthy fish, 500 ml of pond water, thermometer to measure the temperature, stopwatch, ice cubes to decrease the temperature and hot water to increase the temperature of water. Take 500 ml of pond water in a fish tank. Introduce a healthy fish. Keep the fish for 10 minutes for acclimation in the laboratory conditions. Observe the water temperature with the help of a thermometer. Note the time for 50 opercular movement. Then it be noted. Take three trials. Here we can use hot water to increase the temperature of water and ice cubes to decrease the water temperature. Note the time required for 50 opercular movement at different temperatures and the values are recorded. Here in this table, effect of temperature on opercular activity in fish can be calculated by using the formula 1 divided by time taken for 50 opercular movements. The values were noted in the table as temperature in degree Celsius time taken for every 50 opercular movements in seconds. 1, 2, 3, there are 3 trials, then average time taken T, then average value of these three trials then rate of activity that is 1 divided by t. Q10 can be calculated by using the formula R2 by R1 into 10 divided by T2 minus T1. What is R1 rate of activity at initial temperature? Then R2 rate of activity of final temperature that is 31 degree Celsius. T1 initial temperature, T2 is the final temperature. When we substitute the value into the formula, we will get the answer as 2. That means rate of activity increases. Then the result can be written as rate of opercular activity at 21 degrees equal to 0 0.0270. At 26 degrees equal to 0 0.0480. 31 degrees Celsius 0 0.0555. At 36 degrees Celsius the rate of opercular activity is 0 0.0666. When water enters through the mouth and come out through the gill, transport of oxygen into the bloodstream take place. The rate of opercular activity will increase by increase in temperature. Because you know, there are many reasons for this. 
when the temperature of water increases amount of dissolved oxygen will be less the respiratory rate in fish will increase so the operculum will move fastly when the temperature reduces dissolved oxygen will be more and fish will get more oxygen hence the opercular activity decreases moreover temperature directly affect the metabolic rate also when temperature increases the metabolic rate in fish also increases hence it need more oxygen hence the opercular activity increases in colder water the metabolic rate will be less so as the respiratory activity decreases as you know fish is a poikilothermic or cold blooded animal hence the body activity directly depends on the environmental temperature in the present experiment we change the temperature of water and analyze the respiratory or breathing rate of fish counting of opercular movement in fish is a way to calculate respiratory rates in fish students are getting an idea of response of a fish to an ecological change the opercular rate is doubled as the temperature rises from 21 degree to 31 degree celsius in the present experiment the q10 value is 2 that means the rate of opercular activity doubles from 21 degree to 31 degree celsius when this happens the q10 value for the reaction is 2 the value holds true to numerous biological reactions dear friends thank you for watching don't forget to leave a like and please subscribe my channel